All right, so that is the, the second mechanic you have in your hand that your hand does is a roll, okay? And this, what this does is, for most of the shots I throw, and you look here, the blade of my sword is coming straight down the Y of my thumb. Uh -huh. However, there are certain shots that I want to throw. I want to let the, the blade shift in my hand, so now it is no longer coming down the Y of my thumb, but is coming out, the blade is now oriented here, at my here versus here. Here's position one, here's position two. And being able to switch between those is what allows you to make a really, really short arc of recovery, for example, on your onside to offside. For example, one of the, the, the big reasons why people repeatedly throw flat in the SCA, okay? We go onside, offside, okay? They have no, no rotation in their hand. Even if I get a big rotation here, I'm, this is still actually not quite blade on. To get it fully blade on, I have to let it shift from that. This here is in that deep Y position. Here is my thumb. So by letting it come offside to onside, I can make a, a much shorter transition to there rather than having to bring my hand back further. Okay. Without, and then, and then the, the practice for that was just going through like the, the 180, the 45. Do you do it the opposite direction as well? Will that help? Um, you like, can. Like you can actually go the body like, as well as the outside. There are. Um, there's a, um, there are several people that I know that will actually let their hand turn here so that the blade is actually coming out the back, pointed out the back of the hand. Uh -huh. And that mostly has to do for throwing that yeah, shot. I've seen Francis and Kirk throw those. Right. Um, a, a lot of people that throw that back of the blade on side or, um, uh, or Moliné, a uh, back blade Moliné, uh, uh -huh. Duke Alanon throws the shot. And when he throws it, you watch him, he che uh, or if you watch video on him, he, he, he lets the blade, he cheats the blade forward. Most oh. people, when they hold their blade here, it's, cheat, it's here. He'll turn it to here before throwing that shot so that when he drops it, it's cutting the blade on. Oh. Okay. Here, this is, if you were to throw this shot, uh -huh. sitting in the Y of your, the y of your hand, uh -huh. right? For me to get blade on, you really have to exaggerate I, everything. Yes, and I have to turn my body this Which, far. Yeah. Okay. What I what is easier to do is turn it is to get that rotation here so that my hand because if my hand is bent here, uh -huh. there's only so far it can rotate. Uh -huh. Right. When my hand is here, I can rotate much farther. So I by by rotate but to do that. To keep my hand in that position, I have to compensate by having the blade turned in my hand to there. So now I can get that power there. Now, I don't throw that shot. Yeah, it's I'm not it's really it's that. it's it's awkward. Uh -huh. Okay, but in like manner, um, you'll also see people who throw the thumb lead offside. Yeah, right. That that's the Moliné, the back blade Moliné, uh -huh. right? But this is. Oh yeah, I always wondered how people did that. Yeah, yeah, no. So when they do that, I have to shift my grip into the into the, the thumb position uh -huh. for it to come blade on. Okay? Then from there I can rotate very quickly back for that on side. Or to the the wall of me. Okay. Come through there to there. Okay. Alright, so those are the, the, the hand mechanics.